seen if people were to give their lives, uh, my God, and then there's no one there to help them grow. Well, what would it mean if someone says, I need help, and there's no one there to help them, no one there to pray for them, no one there to nurture them? Because when you get born again, you get born again as a baby. You don't get born grown. Those are robots. Hallelujah. But when you come to Christ, you are now a babe in Christ. You act just like a natural baby. You yell whenever you feel like it. Huh? You spit up on folk in public. You will poop and do anything else. Hallelujah. In public. Because you're a baby and that's what babies do. Babies have to be cared for. That goes back to the harvest. There's a responsibility on us. There's a responsibility on the ministry. There's a responsibility on the priesthood to make sure that God sees that he bursts into the kingdom are cared for properly. I want to serve notice to every preacher, every teacher, every reacher under my voice. This is not about your ego. This is not about your position, your status, your title. Hallelujah! Woo! Glory! This is about being in the kingdom. This is about making the sacrifice so that others can live. This is about God calling you for such a greater purpose than making your name be in life. Anybody can do that now. Hallelujah! You can go get one of them Christmas things that shoot all over your house. Make you a little thing and put it in your name with being lights all over your house, all over your neighborhood. But what in the need, what in the world, what in the good is that? When people are dying and as they used to say, going to hell in the handbasket. Our world needs real people serving the real Jesus. Hallelujah. Our world needs to show love and compassion. Our world needs to show forgiveness. Because if God were to mark iniquity, who would stand? Who would stand? We all were born. We all were born in sin, shaped in iniquity. We came here on our way to hell. Only Jesus makes the difference. Only Jesus' blood cleanses us from all unrighteousness. Let me continue reading here. Hallelujah. I don't know where my time is going. But, but, but look at this. Who may abide the day of his coming? And who shall stand when he appeareth? For he is a refiner's fire and a fuller soul. And he shall sit as a refiner and purify and purify of silver. And he shall purify the sons of Levi and purge them as silver and gold. I, I was telling, I was telling the, the members on Sunday that, you know, again, being born in the country, George, you, you, ever, you ever saw Lasso? 